Hello everyone, my name is Aditya. In this video, we'll see how to use the DigiSpark 80 Tiny 85 development board. So this is how the board looks like. It is the smallest and uh, cheapest uh, board available, uh, the microcontroller that we can use for your project. So it has an inbuilt uh, USB serial debugger, so you can uh, directly uh, plug in to your uh, laptop or computer and program it using Arduino IDE. So it has six I/O pins, as we can see from P0 to P5, and it has four uh, ADC pins, as you can see P2, P3, P4, and P5. And then it also has three PWM pins on uh, P0, then P1, then P4. So on the left, you can see it has a, a VIN pin uh, to supply input voltage, and also has a five volt output. So this is a great uh, development board and it is very compact uh, if uh, your project has uh, very limited pins uh, you can uh, use uh, this board okay so now let's see the board uh, itself so this is a board itself digispark 80 tiny 85 development board so we have a uh, separate pin headers given so we need to solder this onto the board so let's solder and come back So after the soldering is done, just plug the device to the computer. So once you plug in, you will see an LED glows. So that means this board is working fine. So now remove this for now. And you need to add uh, the boards manager for this. So go to file, preferences and in additional boards manager URLs, you need to add this particular URL. So I leave the link in the description uh, for this just copy it and then paste it here and then click on OK. So after that go to board manager and type digistump. So in that install the first uh, the boards that is uh, digistump AVR boards. So it will also install the LLC driver uh, which is required so just click on OK for that. So after that is installed all you need to do is select the DigiSpark from Tools Board in DigiStump AVR Boards select the DigiSpark default 16.5 so after you select the board just you can give upload and uh, it will uh, tell plug in device now so this is the time where you need to plug in the device so as you can see if it is successfully uploaded, it gives that micronucleus done. Thank you. So this is how uh, we upload a sketch onto our uh, the DigiSpark 80 Tiny 85. So now we'll try to glow the inbuilt LED, which is present. So the inbuilt LED is present on uh, pin number one. So I'll define uh, an LED pin. Uh, int LED is equal to one. So after this, I'll make this as a output. And then right one comma low then sorry LED then delay of 1000 then uh, right LED comma high LED comma high again give a delay of uh, 1000 milliseconds so what this code does is that uh, it will make pin number 1 as output because uh, pin number 1 is the where uh, the inbuilt LED is connected so it will make it as an output and uh, the digital right inside the loop it will make it low for 1 second and high for 1 second 
so we will try to upload this so for that remove the board then press upload then it will ask to plug in the device now so when you see the message plug in so as we can see once it's uploaded you can see that the red inbuilt LED is blinking so that's it for the tutorial hope you liked it we'll see in the next tutorial thank you